My boy, no, please. no, it is a girl. Says who? I told you already yesterday, it's an angel that looks exactly like no, me. No, he's a prince that looks exactly like me. No, I'm he, going, I'll, I'll kick you now. He is a boy. I will kick you Oh, off. no, he is a boy. No, that boy right there is mine. What is wrong? I, I'm going to hit you with slippers. But he's a boy. I will kick you now. <laughs> I'll kick you so hard. <laughs> He is a prince. Oh, no. It's a girl. That is my prince I right there. I the slippers. That is my prince right boy. Go. It's a boy. Ah. It's a boy. Oh. The prince of this kingdom. No. Hey. Oh. Hey. 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 Andy, how are you today? I'm very well, thank you. Outside, some people trying to put it in my head that it's a boy and not a girl. And who could that be? Mm. Well, even the dog knows that he's a boy. No. A prince. Tell him no. My prince. Yeah. Our prince. <laughs> it's a girl. It's a boy. A girl. A boy. A girl. A boy. A girl. A prince. Ah! A boy. A girl. Dog, please tell her it's a boy. Okay, 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 okay. Angel. That prince. means. Prince. 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 No! He's a prince, just like me. Okay? Cover your eyes. Make sure you're keeping on the deal. Do not open your eyes. Okay. Here we are. Hmm. Eyes are open. <laughs> Please stop. What must have desecrated the sacred secretion of your eyes? I wish. I wish for so many things. And I just wish that 
the happiness in this home. The happiness and friendship between us can circulate everywhere and anywhere. My love, but we are good together. Your mother doesn't like me. There's nothing, there's nothing I do that's good or... Stop. I have told you this severally. You don't have to worry about my mother. You have to worry about me. I am the one that got married to you, not my mother. Listen, our love will stand the test of time. Together, we will stand tall. Together, we will move mountains. Stop. Don't be like that. Yes. <laughs> you know what? Tomorrow, we will go for early morning ride. Ah. Uh, you know how fun that is, yeah? Yes, I do. That's your favorite. <laughs> okay, so when we are done, we will go see Dr. Fred. Ah, uh, yes, it's been a while, right? Yeah. But not until... Simply the best. No! Hey, Mama? What? Mama, what's going on? Why? I'm sick. I'm Mama. Mama, you're not saying anything. What's what? Hey, hey. Kedi no be. I had a bad dream. Your brother, your brother Ubiako. Your brother Ubiako is in danger. I mean, Seke. I should give people mama. They want to kill your brother. Oh, Mama, yeah. who wants to kill my brother? Who else? Who else if not Angelina? Eh? I warned your brother not to marry that woman from Amisieke. He refused. Ochente. Eh? Can they be very easy? Can they be fun? Mama, what's going on? Why? Mama, what's going on? Why? Why? Hi, if you get, I will send it. Angelina, pin go call so that Obiako will not answer the mother. Hey, man on a milli can chaba ma nyamban. I'm going to the city Mama, now. you know where you go to the city this night. Close this now. Angelina, Angelina, back to sender. Angelina, Angelina, give watch all old Galia. He, she wants to kill my son. She wants to kill Obiako for me. I'm in Sieke. I'm I am ready. Let me mama, mama, I beg you, you can't go. Hey, man, I'm you can't go. I'm with Sieke. You decided to kill my son. Nanyam Naba. It's not possible. Angelina, whatever you are planning for my son or you plan, back to sender. Amen. Hey, Bobo Nisi. Anything you are planning to my son, back to sender. Enonenu inonane, hey, Bobo Nisi, I'm with Sieke. Back to sender. Back to sender. Angelina, no tutu back to sender. Whatever you plan for, Biako, back to sender. I am sending all of them back. Chelu, Chelu. Back to sender. Back to sender. Back to sender. plan. Whatever you are planning for my son. Biako, one Back to sender. No, Toto. Back to sender. Never back to sender. Angelina, ask him back to sender. Angelina, ask him back to sender. No, no, to my name. Back to sender. Angelina, back to sender. Ever put this? Is everything okay? Angelina, ask him back to sender. Back to sender, Angelina. Ask him back to sender, Angelina. Ever put this? Is everything okay? Angelina, ask him back to sender. Back to sender, Angelina. 
Hey, Angelina, back to sender. Whatever it is, must be very serious. Why did you guys come to the office? Because you were busy, so I thought staying here would be preferable. The nurse said you were very busy. So you are now strangers, eh? Oh, <laughs> ah, well, yeah. No, we just decided to wait for you here. Yeah, thank God. So, you are stopping. No, 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 no. I see. Not birds. Dr. Fred is here. Sorry, doctor. And who cares, Dr. Fred? Who cares, for real? No, I'm not with him on that. I care. No, but for real, I don't care. I, we care. No, don't listen to him, but we honestly think it's about time you get married. <laughs> yeah, that is true. Honestly, you need to settle down. Alright? And not just to any woman, but a queen. Oh, God. It's, it's alright. <laughs> Marriage here, I come. Mm. <laughs> Good. Back to why we're here. The sampler asked you to come with you. The first morning you're in. Oh, I... Oh. I left it on the table. I mean, I, I, I did the urine sample, but I... I forgot it on the table in the room. Uh, no, no, I, I'll just um, run along to get it real quick. Yeah. I'll go with you. No, 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 Oh, just, I swear. Oh, yeah. Sorry, no. <laughs> What are friends for? The guy is funny. You better know who to and who not to trust. You better know who to, who to and who not to trust. You better know who to and who not to trust. It's not connecting. Please. About two 
I'm surprised.
Bianca. Hello, Bianca. I need to see you now. Please, calm down my friend. Everything will be fine. This is strange. Where's my husband? Bianca, where's my husband? Hello? Yes? Any news yet? Okay, your husband is fine wherever he is. Maybe he might have stepped out to get something. No <laughs> cause no. to worry. No. No, tell me not to worry. He left me at the hospital to come home and get me something. This vehicle was the same vehicle he drove. To the house. Okay, the vehicle is here. He's nowhere to be found. The particular object he came home to get for me is up there, untouched. I've searched every nook and cranny in this house and I still can't find him. You, you stand there and you ask me to come down? How? How am I supposed to calm down? How? Just I'm sitting everywhere. You, you, you have to get hold of yourself, my friend. You have to. I'm just trying. Have you, please, can you just try again? Please. I've searched everywhere. I've searched everywhere. Who is it? I'll get it, I'll get it. Oh, yeah, come on. 
Where's Obia? Mama, please. Where's Obia? Mama, calm down, please. Get him, Obia, come on. Obia, come on, me. We are not near land here. Get him, Obia, come. I am his mother and I am here. I am the one that gave birth to him. I carried him for nine months in my womb. I know he intentionally switched off his phone so that he will not answer his mother's call. Because you are leaving this house this minute. Where is my son? Mama, I am. Um, he. Jelina, I'm asking you, you shouldn't take. Am I not talking to somebody? Go to the Where is Obiakon? Mama, I. Mama, I mean. I mean, 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 We've been looking for him since morning. But I believe he will soon be back. He will. A slogan. Who are you looking for? Hey! Hello, Mudale! La 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 la, put up what he said. Jelina, Mama, Angelina, one more to. Angelina, Angelina, where did you hide my son? Where all of those? Where is Sophia? Come, Mama. Where is Sophia? Come, Angelina. Where is Sophia? Hi. Hello, Mama. Hello, Mama. Where all of those? I don't know. Mama, I assure you, Prince is okay wherever he is. He is. Angelina, come down, come down, please. Angelina. <laughs> to get something and I haven't seen him since. But how true is this thing they say about Amisiki women? That they are being used to destroy men. My question is, what would they gain by doing that? Left to me, I believe it is mere fallacy. What would anyone gain by destroying someone who has become a part of them? Did you not also hear that it's something they do not have control over? Are you saying they are also being manipulated? 
I still don't believe this. Angel. to get hold of yourself. No one was calling you. You don't have to allow this get into your head. It's barely 24 hours your husband got missing. Are you really behaving like this? Calm down, he will return. He will surely come back. No. You mean Prince is not yet back? No, he's not. But he will... You have to call him now. Call him to stop playing with us and ask him to come back home. The child and I can no longer wait. We cannot stay one more minute without him. Bianca, call him. Call him now. Call him to stop playing and get back home. I'll call him now. We can't look for him anymore. We can't, we can't be worried anymore. Call him to come back now. His child wants to see him. Call him, call him. Angel, calm down. Your husband will... Shh. Don't let it go. Don't let it go. I love you. What? He's calling! Can't you hear that? Angel, stop this! You're losing it! Look at what you're doing to yourself! Your husband will return! <gasps> he's here, he's here. I can hear him. I can hear him clearly. Why can't you hear him? He's here. I can oh. hear... Shh! Just listen, please. 
<laughs> Can you hear that now? No. Open your ears and listen, I can't hear. This whole thing is, is complicated. I really don't know why I'm, I'm having this feeling that all is not where we place wherever it is now. Yeah, come to think of it. If his car is not packed in his compound, His entrance door and that of his bedroom are open. An indication that he entered the house. But the sample he came to pick is untouched. Or should, should we put it this way? If his car was not packed in his compound, one could assume that he never got home or that he actually came and left. But on the other hand, if what he came home to pick has been removed from where the wife said it was, what could say assume that he came home, he picked it, perhaps his car developed faults and he decided to use the you know, public or transport vehicle. To return these two situations could have accepted praise from the house. What do you think, Bella? I get your points, Dr. Fred. I am quite confused as you are. Honestly, we have to take this very seriously. Because with what I witnessed yesterday. Angel will not survive it if anything should happen to Prince. I'm sure of that. Prince has already been betrayed by his son.
Right in your arms is where I find this I looked in your eyes, I see eternity Under your bond is where I wanna be Forever and ever Don't let it go, don't let it go I love you I love you Cause I won't let go Won't let go Oh baby I love you You are the angel of my life Mama, 
Again. They have done it again, though. Help! Wait, wait. Let it not be what I am thinking. Mama, Bodobiako is dead. You lied, Jack. Who told you that? Mama, the news is everywhere now. They said his wife killed him and he has started tormenting her. As I speak to you now, Bodobiako's mother is back to this village. I then decided to check her up at home, only to find her lying unconsciously on the floor. So, what of Mama? She wasn't there, and her phone number isn't going through. Thank God the baby is still in Glory be to God. Thank God. Doctor, just, just help my friend. Do everything possible, please, for her to be fine. Come down. She's sick and sick. Okay. Pinja. Pinja. Eh? Are you okay? Yanka. Eh? My prince. Hey. Where's my prince? Yanka. Eh? Yanka. Mm -hmm. He's calling my name. Hey. He's not happy where he is, Bianca. I can hear his voice. Don't worry, your priest will come to you. Please, calm down. Don't worry, you'll see Prince again, okay? Doctor. Yes. Dr. Fred. 
You are his best friend. Promise you take me to him. Promise. Yanka. Mm -hmm. Dr. Fred wants to take me there now. He's calling my name. Mm -hmm. He's not happy. He's calling my name. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yanka, take me there. Not now, please. My friend. To talk to her. No, no, Fred, no, no, please. No. Tell her to calm down. Hmm? He's not happy where he is. He's sad. He's calling out my name. The treatment isn't good. The treatment is very bad. Please take me to him. Calm down. Relax. Relax. You'll see your friends once again. Please. <laughs> Angel hears voices. Her husband's voice. What does that mean? Could it be that something has happened to Prince? Or is he? We wouldn't conclude yet. There are a thousand and one reasons that could make one hear voices. Especially that of a loved one. Calm down. We, your kissmen, we will make sure we get to the root of this matter. You see, matters concerning death must be handled with every seriousness because it is a delicate one. And we must make sure we invite our wife to come and explain herself. Um, 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 um. <clears throat> Inna Nkoku, please don't be angry. Eh? Don't be angry that I interrupted you. Hmm? Uh -huh. But what kind of explanation do you want her to come and explain now? Eh? Which one? You know these Amisike people. You know their way of life. Once you marry from them, is it that they kill you, maim you, incapacitate you, or make you handicapped? All in the name of trying to take charge. The women want to be in control. Hey, so what do you want as you want? Have you forgotten that my only brother, my only brother was killed by them? Even though he could see his uh, brother, he was killed also for no just cause. Well, what is there for her to explain again? She, she's a witch! She's the one who killed our, our son. Mbakwe. Mbakwe, you have spoken very, very well. Who could get them? But I want you to listen to me. Matters concerning death is a serious and delicate one that must be handled with caution. See, we do not have proof. We do not have proof yet to conclude on this matter. Yes, we do not have proof. Inaikoku, Biko, Biko, what proof do you want? What other proof do you want? When the spirit of our brother is already tormenting her. Eh? See, our wife here, you heard her. She caught her and her dead. Begging the spirit of our brother to forgive her, to stop tormenting her. So what does that prove you want? Tell me. She is guilty and she must pay. Mbakwe, and, um, I think I am in support of Naikoku's point of view. Oh. She is our daughter as well. Let us invite her over to hear from her own side of the story. If eventually she is found guilty, she must face the consequences of her action. 
at wow. once. Oh, no one. Um, we oh, no one. He, he no. already is guilty. What else you want? He's no. guilty. No. Wait. Ah. Calm down. We must follow this. Eh? Um, Uyai, calm down. Eh? Calm down. We will get to the root of this matter. You should know me. Take care. Kenyada no no no, a woman aboro. An elder does not sit at home and watch the she go deliver in Taita. Angelina, our daughter. I am sure you have been pre informed or you are aware the reason for this meeting. Your husband, our brother Obiako, is missing. And all fingers are pointing at you. I choose to ask you here and now to tell us the truth. Nothing but the truth. Before it's Omona, all you know about the disappearance of Obiako, your husband. My fathers, I do not know anything about his disappearance. We were both at the hospital together. When I forgot the sample, the doctor had asked me to bring. He offered to rush home and get the sample. Up until now, I haven't seen him since then. Jelena. Jelena is so Jelena is so Jelena, if you know where you are hiding my son's body, go and bring him for me. Jedu talum nyabiko. Jedu talum nwam. Biko kanna yobu. Jelena. Jelena, go and bring my son's body. Makanu nebu go kwa kunu siyebu. Mama, I don't know anything about it. I don't know where he went. I don't even know what has happened. Hey, Jelena, are you denied because you are in my house? In a gag go. Hi, Jelena, hello, 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 man. I don't care in car. You do tamu mum. If you know where you are hiding my son, go and bring him for me, Jelena. Jelena, go and bring my son. I'm begging you, Jelena. Please, uh, Angelina, do not lie before the elders. Is it true you have been hearing the voice of our son calling on your name? Has our son's voice been tormenting you? Stop this! Um, um, don't answer the question. Is it true that you are hearing the voice of your husband without seeing it? Yes, my. Hey, Aru. Abomination. But I, I did not, I don't understand. And Bianca, I told you, I don't, I don't understand why. Aru. So it is. Yabuka Yoku. So it is true you really killed my brother. No, he's not dead. Are you talking back at me? 
Are you talking back at me? Get out of here. Get out. 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 Get out.
I'm breathing. Okay, fine. Relax. I'm relaxed. You said you saw your husband. Yes. He walked past you. He never spoke to you. No. And the next minute you couldn't find him. At all. How? I don't understand. I don't understand. I mean, I, I was coming and then I saw him, I recognized him and I, and I stood. And then he just walked past me. Not one word. Bianca, I prayed all night. I prayed to God all night to bring him close to me. I'm so certain that he heard my prayers. He heard my voice. And then I find him and then he doesn't say anything to me. I think he's angry. She thinks he's angry with me. Because like, he saw me and literally passed by. Like, without saying anything. He's angry, right? You think he's angry? He must be very upset, right? Look. We've had enough of this Amui Seke people. Yes, it's only a fool that steps on feces, feels it and tastes it. It's high time we ban our children from marrying from them. Yes, we have to ban them. Because each time they marry from them, they end up, end up dead or completely useless. Yes. GM, it has not gotten to that. Let us face the issue at hand. Forget that your proverb. Forget it. Forget it. All I am saying is that Angelina should come and answer for her crimes. She should come and pay for what she has done. She must face the consequences. I quite understand you, Ichi Mbakwe. I'm actually on your side. Call a this girl or somebody who's in Uche. Where would it take it personal? Tell me why I shouldn't take it personal. Have you forgotten so soon that the same people killed my only brother? My only brother, they killed him. And I'm going to say a woman killed my only brother. Killed my only brother and we did nothing about it. What was the consequence? Misfortune befallen us and our children. Look, we cannot allow murderers to go scot free. She must pay. Yes. She has to pay. Mbakwe. Okay. Okay. Angelina is still pleading innocence. But let me also ask, are we going to make her to face the consequences of taking another person's life when we have no proof of her being guilty? Something keep bothering me. How are we sure that our brother Obiako is dead? And if he is dead, where is the dead body? What proof do you need? Tell me. What else do you need? Tell me how you will explain a situation where a woman keeps hearing the sound, the voice of our sin husband. And this voice keeps tormenting her. Tell me. Umuna, is that not a sign of bad omen? Eh? Is it not? Let me tell you, I will say people are cursed. They are cursed and there's nothing they can do about it. It's beyond them. So all I'm saying is that Angelina should come and pay for it. If not, if we don't do anything about it, this thing will boomerang on us and misfortune will, will befall us and all our kindred, our children. Yes! Just to pay! dead. Everyone is worried sick about you and you are here. My goodness, it's, it's 
you? What are you doing here? You almost killed me with panic. Let's go home. Everyone has to see that you're fine. Let's go home now. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Stop. Everybody wants to see you. Let's hey, go. hey, hey. What is going on here? Enough of this young lady. I don't know who you are. Excuse me. Let's go. No, wait! No! Dr. Fred, have you got an idea if Mr. Prince has got any issues with anybody, business or otherwise, or probably have some issues with anybody recently? Mm, none that I know of, officer. How close are you to Mr. Prince? Very close. Very close. Very close. Yes. Your office was the last place he was seen before the disappearance. Yes. Now, tell us, what was your discussions like before he left? Officer, I hope you're not expecting me to discuss the privacy of a husband and wife with you. For Granada Loud, I was the one that reported him missing at the police station. Why all these questions? Oh, so sorry about that. We're only trying to make sure we left no stones on turn. Then do that with some modicum of respect. Um, I was actually on my way out when you got stepped in. friend of yours and they were my princess. She knows you. She knows us. She knows about the emotional trauma you have been through lately. And she's willing to help. If only you will calm down and take all her instructions. Young girl. Yes. Does she know where my prince is? Can she take me to my princess? Um, 
When we get there tomorrow, we'll find out. No. Please. Let her take me to my princess. Let's go there now. Now? Let's go there now. No, Pianca. it's late already. Right. We can go there by this no, time. No, no, no. We have to go there now. She knows you're my princess. She has to take me there. Listen, you have to come uh, back. I promised you that I would take you there. I will. No. No. Let's go. I, I promised I was going to take you there. I, I will. No. No. Let's go. Let's go there now, Bianca, please. Let's go to where my prince is. I'm begging you, please. please. She knows where my prince is. This friend of yours knows. Let's go there now. Tomorrow, no. We'll do no. That. Let's go there now. Calm down. Calm. You need to calm down. Please. Calm down. Let's go there now. Calm down. Okay, right, right. Your friend knows. You need to sleep. Oh, Sweetheart, you need to come. I have sat down here listening to every single thing you have to say. But don't sit here and call my husband a ghost. Damn, I never said so. I am not your sweetheart. Tell her. He's not dead. He can't be dead. I felt him. The warmth. It was him. He's alive. Bianca, tell her. Tell her. Calm down. I never said so. Can you tell her to stop asking me to calm down? Ask her to... In your arms is where I find this. I looked in your eyes, I see eternity. Under your bond is where I wanna be forever and ever. Don't let it go, don't let it go. I love you. I love you Cause I won't let go Won't let go Oh baby I love you What's wrong with Angel? What was I mean? What, what was she thinking about? What must have led her into slitting her own hands? I only took her to a psychotherapist to see if she could have a word with her because of her present behavior. There was a little misconception, and she left the office. I followed her up immediately, only to find her in that condition at home. This is seriously turning to something else. 
Kanka, we've got to keep a close watch on Angel. Honestly. Straight is so much for her. This might end up affecting the condition of the baby in her womb. No. If proper care is not taken. God forbid. Yes. I'll, 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 I'll take care of her closely. I will. that you don't get. I'm telling you, there is something strange about this woman in world form. Anita, I struggled with both hands. With enough strength. Just to detach a red picture from her hand. Twice. Her single hand. My dear, do you know that when I turned to face what I was doing, the next thing I saw her hand slowly moving and then she grabbed the pigs. This is a woman that has been totally unconscious up till now. That's how her husband and picture both used to come here and I learned that her husband has been missing for some days now. <laughs> hmm. I see the case of soul connection here. What's that? You see, listen. In as much as I read it in the book back in school those days, but it's still obvious that Sorge has come to play in reality. She must be so connected to her husband, or probably fond of him. The picture serves fill up the distance between them. You see, when you are so connected to someone, you feel the connection on an energetic level. No matter what you do, you can't eliminate the energy, energetic ties that links the two of you on the cosmic plane. That's it. 
am lost. Read up, miss. Or rather, ask for. I saw him again. You saw who? I saw Prince and that, that girl. I saw him. Where? At, at Flames Fast Food. I saw him there. I saw him with my own eyes. That, that cannot be possible, Angel. The only Flames Fast Food that you and I know of is the one in Abuja. So how, how come? I, I saw him there. I, yes, I, I, Bianca, you're my best friend. If everybody thinks I'm crazy, you can't join them in thinking I'm crazy. I'm not crazy. I saw him well, you, with that girl. You can't. Oh, of course, that's not possible. Just a few minutes ago, you were in the hospital right here in Asaba. So how can you be telling me that you saw your husband at Flames Fast Food in Abuja? I saw him. I saw him and that girl. It was the same girl. Hey, hey. Girl, we have to calm down. Oh, we really have to calm You're losing it. Down. So sad, I saw him. He was with that girl. Ah, what the girl girl. Was... Oh, oh, baby girl. Chelsea. Oh, Bye, dear. When can you come back from the right? Just please don't miss out to me. Don't worry, I've got a nice house for you. Oh, that baby. is the girl. That's her. That's the girl. Which is the one I saw with? You are this. Who? Look at my husband away from me. 
No! Don't let that girl come close to me. Just calm down. You have to calm down. That is the same woman I saw him with at Flames Restaurant. Remember me? That is the girl I saw him with. She's the one. No, hold yourself together. <laughs> What is going on here? Angel! Angel! Come on, go, let's let's try this. Fred, put your knee! What are you doing? Fred, Fred, please come and help us leave the house, please. Please go, please go. Please go. Please go. Come on. So okay. I only met her once. Sometime last year in Abuja. Do you remember the overprotective lady I told you about? The one I met with the husband at Friends last food. Yes. She was the one. Go on. Wow. Come on, girl. No one is taking your man away from you. <laughs> no. No one can take this man away from you. So what if I say that I can take him away? Does this have any connection to what Angel is passing through right now? Does it? Somehow it does. We've handled similar cases. And I've taken time to study Angel's case. Right from the moment you started complaining about her, before you brought her to me. This is a clear case of DRC. Dream, reality, confusion. A mental disorder where someone finds it difficult to differentiate between dream, reality, and imagination. Angel has created a world of fantasy on her own. A world where she imagines and assumes things. And when she wakes up from assumption and imagination, she combines it with her present state reality. Um, please, can you just break this down to a layman's understanding? Because I am lost here. She's saying that she always sees me with her husband. How does this whole thing relate to me? Because 
You all know that I've been far away in Dubai for a couple of weeks now. I don't, I don't get it. That is a world of fantasy she created on her own. She already saw you as a threat. As someone who tried snatching her husband in the past. Because she never believed her husband could be gone so far away from her. She always imagines him around. But when he's not there in the world she created, you turn out to be the threat factor. When she was from the States and couldn't find him, she joins the dream to her present state to make up a reality for herself. This is really bad. In other words, Angel has not been seeing her husband all this while like she claimed. She probably has, but only in her imaginations. This is what happened when two people who are so connected to each other, body and soul, tends to be separated in a most unusual circumstance. Honestly, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm sure the words, you know. If Chelsea here were to be a stranger, I would have gotten the police involved in this case. I must be friends with you. My, 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 my hands are tied, say, friends. The possibility of getting the, the police involved is very slim here. It's okay, it's okay. I'm done. Yes. Sorry. Angel, there's nothing wrong with you, please. Please. Angel, you, need, you just need to rest, okay? You'll be fine. Any news from the city yet? <laughs> My sister, no news. But I don't need to wait for any news before I do what I have in my mind. What does that mean? Relax now. <laughs> Just relax. By the time I strike, just relax. <laughs> I don't get far to talk. And that's it. I don't get I don't. Ah ah, Ilechi. Why are you tiptoeing like a thief who have come in the night to steal? Madaka, what is it? What is it? Will I kill myself for you? And when has it become a crime for someone to come and talk to one sister? When? Sister? Hey! Hey! Oh! Like you don't know that Ikedi's mother and my mother are from the same umuna. In the same village. Does that not make us relations? No one is dragging sistership with you. So come and carry her and go and do the gossip that brought you here. We're discussing something very important before you sneaked in here like a thief. You see? You see the reason why I want to bring my sister to a particular corner and discuss with her dead jelly. Because Almighty Amaka would always take everything that comes out of my mouth as a gossip. Miss Jeje. Oh yeah? Jeje Lee carry her and go and do your Jeje gossip. My sister, come Jerry. Let me tell you important things. Look, I will talk now. I will talk. See, I have useful information about the women of Amasiki. Mm. <laughs> I heard that they use the blood of the men they kill to make their skin very fresh. Hey! 
ilechi ilencha won ayen merige me e merige me ha what do you gain from manufacturing all these lies to deceive people eh and who told you it's a lie who told you it's a lie <laughs> like mother like daughter nego nu gimo ayere eh what did you say you heard me right amaka did you just call my mother amaka bupoya I don't even have your time. I'm gonna spit it I don't out. I have your time now. I was discussing something. I'm gonna spit your statement out. Don't even talk. I'm gonna spit it out. Okay. <laughs> Going to sit down here and fold our arms and not do anything about this issue. Are we? If the woman are they are not ready to do anything. Mama, we need to move. We need to take laws into our hands. Yes. We cannot just sit down here and leave the woman that is responsible for, for, for my brother's disappearance to just sit down in his mansion and eat his hard-earned money. Mama, it is not possible. We need to move. Kedi Dobi. Kedi Dobi, what are we going to do? Mama, I think it's better we go to the city ourselves and make inquiries. Yes, I have also made investigations about the woman of Hamisinge. Mama, do not be surprised that that woman is hiding brother somewhere so that he will be yielding money for her. Or probably using his blood to replenish her sister. Yeah. Popo, popo, popo. Your brother cannot be yielding money for anybody. He cannot be yielding money for the woman of Ami Sieke. It's not possible. And then we need to move now. Eh, you say we should move, we'll move. We need to move. Eh, Biako cannot be yielding money for anybody. Yeah. One Kim. One Kim cannot be yielding money for anybody. He cannot be yielding money for, for the woman of Ami Sieke. It's not possible. It's not possible. Ah, Obiako. Obi I come my mama go 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 Mama this is your shade the night we need to move Obi I come we need to do something mama Obi I can do 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 one thing do why see Obi I come I was thinking, do you think it's wise leaving Angel all alone, considering her present condition? Especially now that she's been discharged from the hospital. I honestly thought about it and I'm considering seeing her later today at home so we can discuss it. Maybe she will start living with me for now until this whole thing is over. Honestly, I, I feel so much for... Excuse me. Hello, Angel. What? What is it? I, I, I'll call you back now. The mother-in-law is at home making trouble with her. Oh, not again. <sighs> If you don't want me to kill you and bury you here right now and now, 
You better tell me what you have done to my brother. Yes. Tell me! I don't know. Tell me that because. Hey. Mama. Angelina, where is Obiako? He left me at the hospital to go and get some things. Until now, I've not seen him. You better be my brother. You better be my brother. Be my brother. Yeah, bro. Mama. 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 You better go and bring this. Obiako. If you know where you're hiding him, bring him out. Please. You don't want to talk him? You don't want to? I don't know. Ah. Mama, what's going on? Angel just got discharged from the hospital. She doesn't need Who cares? Who cares? Whether she's been discharged from the hospital or from the mortuary. Is she better than the life of my son? Bianca. Eh? Bianca. Eh? What's going on here? If you know where you're hiding my son, you better go and show us. You better bring him out. Oh. You better Bianca. bring him out. Leave me alone. Hey, I'm going to stop you. I'm going to stop you. I'm going to stop you. I'm going to is it because I'm keeping quiet? Angelina, go and bring him. Go and bring him. Go and bring him. Hey, hey, hey! You want to pick which call? Let me pick my call. He pick Mulo. Please. 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 Bring him. Come on, Bianca. Bianca. Excuse me. Please, I don't know. Hello. What? I don't know, Mama. Where? No, I don't know anything. Oh my goodness. Oh no. What is it? What is it now? Talk. Prince. Prince has been found. Where? Where? Bianca, where? Bianca, where? His scalp still looks so fresh. You guys said he's been gone for more than a week now. Yes, of course. So? Chris must have died in less than 24 hours before now. Um, in other words, an autopsy must be carried out to us until the cause of death. This is so sad. So, so sad. All along, Angel kept saying it. Prince wasn't dead. She said that her husband wasn't dead. Or he's in pain, wherever he is. She was right after all. Angel was right. Prince is gone. I just, I just pray Angel recovers from this whole shock. I just pray so.
Youths of Umwezika Umodara. Anger is in your voices. Yes. What warranted this? Mazi Koko, we greet you. We are actually on our way to your house. We are happy we met you here. We, the youth of this village, are in pain. Yes. We are very angry. Yes. Yes. Because Nezibo father to go. Yes. Yes. have done it again. They have taken over all our lands as if that one is not enough. Now they have used their women now to perpetrate their evil acts. <laughs> they have killed our brother, Obiako. Now he's a true son of this land. <laughs> and we cannot fold our hands allow this thing to happen again. Never. 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 If something is not done this time around, we are going to take loss into our hands. Yes. 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 I have had you, my children. And I feel your plight. I understand your plight. But I want to ask you one question. Who amongst you here can tell me it has a proof that Angelina actually killed the husband of Yakov? Yes, 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 Now you see proof. We have proof. Aside the fact that this is not the first time a son of the soil dying mysteriously in the hands of only second women. Yes. Secondly, we heard from a reliable source that the person she sent to kill her husband called her on phone and told her that they have dumped the husband's body, where she asked them to dump him. Yes. Yes. That was how Tobiako! Tobiako! Hey! Dimba! Hey! 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 We are not sounding disrespectful. We've been looking for you as the eldest of this kindred. Oh no, 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 no. Yes. To let you know that if nothing is done and done fast, we yes. do you. Yes. 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 We take the law in our hands. It's okay. My children, I have heard you. You can now go. We'll take care of it. We will take care. But people that think they know it all will always take what I say for gossip. I said it that that Amisike woman has hidden my brother's body somewhere and, is, and she's using his blood to expand, prolong her lifespan. Hey! 
Ilechi, Ilencha. Cho, 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 cho. Make sure you will close this your mouth. Must you talk every now and then? Amaka, what is it? I'll give it to It's like you don't know when to talk and when not to talk. I'm beginning to think that you're really not okay. My sister, where are you going to? You could go, young. You have seen, right? Don't you put your hands in my eyes here. Don't put your hands in my eyes. Ha! Every time you be talking, both the one you see and the one you do not see. What is it? You have to talk. You have to talk. Know what you are doing with your hand. If that your hand touch me, if it touches me, it's me and you in this house. Anything you see, you talk see. about. I don't be. Angel, she just left the ward now and has refused to go back. What do you mean of that? Okay, wait, I'll call you back. No, we have a serious issue in the hospital. Very serious. Yeah, yeah, serious. <laughs> I'll call you back, please. What's up? Has Zuma finally gone back to the world? <laughs> yes, she has. Dr. Fred ha had to lead her back to the world. He gave her some injections. Mm. I thought she was proving stubborn. <laughs> My dear, you see, eh, that woman has really suffered. Honestly. She has, re she has really suffered a lot and I really pity her. I pity her anyway. I pity her a lot. So, what are you guys doing about her? I'm coming. Let me just stop my girlfriend. Oh, okay. Boy. No go face your work, <laughs> boyfriend.
she's obviously yet to get over her husband's death. The shock is still all over her. Please, Mrs. Few, what do you suggest we do? This is gradually developing into something else. Her safety first. Mm. But since Dr. Fred is here, that area is assured. Hmm. We'll keep an eye on her and watch things unfold. And I believe with time, she'll get over that. Mm. Honestly, I... I wish I would wake up one day to realize that all these things we are mere dreams. Angel has passed through a lot in a while. And I'm worried. The stress she's, she's going through now is, is, is just too much for a pregnant woman. Oh my God. Doctor, that's her voice. That angel's voice. I am in pain. My bones has been shrinked. My strength withered away. My enemy has taken away sleep from my eyes. Hi. My only son. I've tried so much to see if I could let go. To see if sleep will ever cross my eyes. But no. Each day that passes keep reminding me of my negligence of duty as a mother. Hey. Naikoku. I saw it coming. I saw it coming. I should have prevented my son's death. Yes. Yes, I should have. I should have been stubborn enough to drag my son out of the lion's den. But no. I kept quiet. I kept quiet and the woman of our Maiseke took away my son from me. 
Oh, Ubiako, 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 Mamu, Ubiako. Hey, it's okay. Nai Koku, I will not rest. I will not rest until the evil woman pays for her sins. Jelena, you will pay for your sins. Obiako. Hello, Melum. Hello, Melumono. Hello, Melmo. Nai Koku. Jelina must pay for her sins. Nai Koku. Jelina will not go free. Oh, Bulumam. Oh, Bulumamo. Obulungwamo nyo chabelo wanoji Obulungwamo makalesia Obulungwamo yo yo mo Jelina Under your spell is where I found me Like you're living inside my head
semuanya Ajong gane de chogi nana Afurong gana taba Kage bili kage siye diyo Ebobo nino No la kwa mebe Iya rapo mitua Kedi feme This is serious. You're supposed to. What? Oh, stop. What? No, no, no. What? I'm going home with him. Who? Oh, Prince, Prince, he has to come back home. Oh, no, I don't. Time. No! No! You just stop. Let go! You look at what you're doing. No, 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 no. Let him go. Hey, let him go. Let me hold no. you. No. What are you doing? Oh, no. 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 Like I told you earlier before now. An elder and the elders in this kindred. There are things I am not supposed to say, but I want to assure you anywhere Angelina is, she is in safe hand. Pending the day of the burial of the husband, Obiako. On the burial day. What happens on that day? Her fate will be decided. Cry not loud, Mr. Fred. Prince is dead. And the best thing we could do right now is to take care of Angel. 
Angel is not just a patient. She is part of us. We are family. If her security is not guaranteed here in your hospital, where else would it be? Really short of words. I'm ashamed of this level of incompetency. This is not just something to write home about. How is she? I'll say she's fine. At least her security is more guaranteed in my house. If no one would take care of Angel, I personally would do that. She's my best friend for crying out loud. I owe her that. And I'm letting you know now that she's not stepping an inch out of my house anymore. Well, that's okay. I'll, I'll be coming from time to time to uh, Mr. Jobs. To... Better. Angel's situation is giving me a cause to worry. Will she ever get back to her normal self again? Is there anything that could be done for my girlfriend to come around? Is there ever a solution to this? Is there? What is it you said about Dolly? The last time she came to my shop. She took the dummy with her. And each time she plays with the dummy, she feels relaxed and happy. Every time. Please, Phil, is there anything you could make out of this? Well, none I could say for now. But I need you to know that her revival is a gradual process. It's something you study her day-to-day -day activity. With that, I believe she will be fine.
That are married to this village. Yes. And we do not support evil. At all. We are saying that Angelina must come and swear. Ma'am. She must come down to this village and swear to prove her innocence. Since she has been claiming that she has no hand in the death of Obiako, her husband. Yes, sir. She has to come and swear so that the consequences of her sins will not befall us and our children. Umuwa Ibem, have I spoken your mind? Yes, sir. We have had you. You can now go. Thank you, our elders. Angelina Meraru. Angelina Meraru. Angelina Meraru. Angelina Meraru. Angelina Meraru. Angelina believe this the villagers want angel to come down to their village and swear her innocence to one ROC or whatever they call it swear to an ROC in this 21st century come on girl you got to be kidding me I'm not kidding you girlfriend Omodara is a very popular town known for its ancient barbaric cultural practices a lot of shit happened in that town that one would wonder if such rubbish still exists in this age and time. It's crazy. What is this? Honestly. Ah, yeah. Fred, have you seen her? Yeah. Angel is doing amazingly well. Mm -hmm. You're doing a great job on her. Mm -hmm. Enough rest for her. What's her friends for? Oh, thanks for you. Thank you. Thank you for coming around. Yeah. Thank you for thanking me. Yeah. Um, I'll keep in touch with you guys, okay? Thank you. Thank you for coming around. Yeah, yeah uh, I'll be hitting my office now. I've, I've got a lot of work to do there. Alright, fine. You better know who to and who not to trust. You better know who to, who to and who not to trust. Please, Chelsea. 
I want you to come with me to Umudara. Angel will also be coming along with us. Don't tell me you're taking Angel to the village to swear to some Arusi or whatever. Of course not. Better. No, Angel is not swearing to any Arusi. But the people of Umudara will not understand it if she doesn't show up. They will think she's guilty and she's running away. So? Chelsea, they are deadly and unpredictable. I want them to see that the condition of the woman they want to crucify is not even nice. She's not even in her right frame of mind. I just pray that they let that woman be. They shouldn't add to what she's already passing through. It's not nice. And you think it's a wise decision? A good idea? I don't know. I don't just know. I'm, I'm as confused as you are. Confused.
innocent. She's innocent of all this. I drove her down myself. I knew she was not in her right frame of mind. I brought her down for you to know that she's not running away from all this. She's not running away. Where were they taking her to? Where? Answer me, where were they taking her to? Chelsea, say something. Where are they taking her to? Baby, just calm down, all right? Uncle, say something to us. Where are they taking her to? Talk to me. Were they going to kill her? Talk to me, Uncle. What is wrong? She hasn't done anything wrong. She's so innocent of all this. And you stand there and say nothing? Uncle. Uncle, please talk to us. Please say something. Oh, I can't believe this. Calm this down. is this is this is this is not nice at all. Oh, I can't believe this. What? What? Uncle, just say something to us. Say something now. I can't take this. I can't. I can't just take this. I can't take this. I can't take this. This is not right. This is this is injustice. And you know that. Why are they hurting her like that? She has not done anything wrong. My daughter, like I told you earlier before now, as an elder and the elders in this kindred, there are things I am not supposed to say, but I want to assure you, anywhere Angelina is, she is in safe hand. Pending. The day of the burial of the husband, Obiako. On the burial day? What happens on that day? Her fate will be decided.
Angelina, she is evil. And no matter what, she will not escape this. Don't make me escape. Hey! Now for me! Hey! Is that one? No, no! Is that one? The mad peace of Uji. What we witness today has never happened. In the history of Umodara, it is a sign of bad omen. We have all come here to ask you on what to do. Please tell us. Go and bury the dead. Eh? Bury the dead without the woman? Look, as we speak, that evil woman that we are supposed to bury alongside our brother Obiaku. It's nowhere to be found. Eh? How the woman managed to escape is still a mystery to all of us. And it shall not remain a mystery forever. The mystery behind what happened today shall be revealed to us in no due time. At the right time, go and bury the dead. Thus says Oji, our God of justice. I'm gonna 
your mother was the love of my life. She was all that I ever wanted. She was the whole world to me. But the evil ones took her away from me. They took your mother away from me. I loved her for all my life. Your mother was the best thing that ever happened to me. Now, I'm left here, all alone, to wander. You are the prince of my world. Under your spell is where I found me. Like you're leaving inside my head. Is he all right? Yeah, yeah. Hey. Eh? This boy is not fine, no. Are you sure? Yes. Obi has been like that ever since his mother went missing. Oh. The little boy misses his mother so much that everything around him means nothing to him. Sometimes he acts strange. Hmm. And for the fact that he is dumb, makes things complicating. Hmm. Because one finds it difficult to know what is in his mind. Yes. What actually happened to the mother? Because it has been long. I saw her last, the mad woman. Different stories. Some said. She was asleep inside a truck and the truck zoomed off while she was sleeping. Hey. And some said she was attacked by bad new people and they used her for ritual. Oh. But I have this feeling. The mother is still alive. Hi. That's sad. Mm -hmm. Huh? is more like a son to me. A son I never had. No. My love for children draws my affection to him. And I had to take good care of him and his mother. It wasn't easy. If only Bulisa Binigwe would take away my sickness. It's okay. 
and extend my lifespan. I wish to take care of him until he grows into a man. I wish to see him happy again with his mother. He is dumb, but I see a lot behind his dumbness. I see a lot concealed in his mouth. He How are you, little boy? Why are you crying? What are you doing here all alone? Where's your mother? 
Where's your dad? He has been behaving strange, behaving very weird, since he started looking for his mother. Sad enough, the old woman that has been taking care of him died just a few days ago. Since then, he refused to stay with anyone else. He rather prefers to wander around. In fact, I don't understand. I do not quite comprehend. I was actually on my way to the neighboring village before I saw this boy. Hey. Doesn't the little boy have uh, siblings, relatives or anyone I could take him to? Hmm. My brother. The only relative of his I know is the mother, the mad woman, that has been off and on around us here for the past seven years. Before she suddenly disappeared. Eh? Some say the mad woman is from Momodara village. I can't say for sure. My problem is this boy's state as a dumb. It's really complicating a lot of things. Eh? I wish he can talk. Mad woman. From Momodara. Eh. Mad woman. Momodara. 
mad woman for me. Yes, that is her. The mad woman. No we. Eh? She's the one. Hey. What are you saying? Are you serious? Why did it take you so long to tell me this? Why? No, 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 don't say that. Don't. Fred, why didn't you tell me this all along? Why? No, 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 it's not a good idea. I mean, taking him to the village is the wrongest idea at this moment. Uh, what more can I do for a friend? Uh, it's fine. I'll be around tomorrow morning. So we'll see, yeah? All right, no problem. My regards to him. Take care. Bye. Son, what's the matter with you? It's okay, it's okay, stop crying. Stop crying. Hey, it's alright. It's okay. Come on, share up, okay? I already told you mommy didn't travel for long. She'll be back soon, okay? Come on, cheer up, okay? <laughs> okay, come on. Come on. Is anybody home, please? Anybody home? Anybody home? Anybody home, please? Hey, Fred. Hi. Uh, I'm so sorry. I didn't know you were here. I How was enjoying my room. Yes. Yeah, so. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Looking good. <laughs> oh my goodness. He's so handsome. Just like his father. Oh. Yeah. Junior has been like this ever since he started looking for his mother. Yes, he, he flares up at the slightest uh, provocation. So I'm going for it. It's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Calm down, okay? 
It's okay, it's alright, huh? Just like I told you, mommy will soon be back. Okay? Sooner than you expected, huh? But very soon, okay? You know I love you. Huh? Nanti here loves you, okay? Okay, henceforth you're gonna be staying with Auntie, huh? Auntie will take good care of you, very good care of you. She'll buy everything for you, huh? Now I'm always busy at work. Yes, as, as usual, now I'll be dropping by to see you, okay? Cheer up, huh? Be staying with her, henceforth, huh? Working at your back to get you down. Oh, you need to sleep. Like that. Good boy. Why 
down. Why are you being so strange? Yeah. I specially made this food for you. So it's time to eat. Okay. What are you doing, Junior? Eat your food. your food junior
Dr. Fred. Yes. I don't understand honestly. Junior is beginning to behave so weird. I don't understand him anymore. He gets angry unnecessarily. You can't believe that he woke up in the middle of the night. Started scattering things in my room. I tried stopping him, he was behaving very stubborn. Huh? And then this morning, I made food. Served him. Huh? He threw the food away. Started running. He was running as if he knew where he was running to. Huh? I honestly don't understand what is wrong with him these days. I don't. Yeah, I'm not surprised though. Though you and I know where his um, aggression is coming from. He's just a little boy that misses his mother so much. So whoever prevents him from worrying around, you know, in search of his mother instantly becomes his enemy. And people who know them very well, as it, uh, the little boy and his mother say they are very much into each other. You know, both of them are alter egos. They go everywhere together. Let me tell you something. Whenever I look at this boy, I see Prince. You know, just like when the when Prince and Angel, you know, when things were going well before the ugly incident, they always together. Again, because we are friends of his parents, we should take proper care of this boy. And if pleases God tomorrow, the mother is found. That will help, you know, is distressing the little boy. Wow, it's so nice, girlfriend. I love it. So, what time is your picture? 7 p.m. on the dot. Wow. And guess what? What? Better thanks for coming on the ground. I trust you. <laughs> Baby girl for life. This is really nice. Thank you, I trust you. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love my outfit. Listen, I mean, what are you saying? It's going to be hot. This is really nice. I know it's it's like a product from your last trip to Dubai. Mm -hmm. Super awesome. I love this. Hey, hey Junior. <laughs> How are you? Junior, come say hi to Auntie Chelsea. Come. Afraid, but this has been his attitude ever since. The poor boy misses his mother so much. He was so close to her that whenever he's not around her, every other thing there means absolutely nothing to him. Oh. What I don't understand is his weird attitude. He behaves so weird that sometimes he wants to run out of this house. Yes, exactly the same thing I suffered in the hands of his mother. It is crazy. I don't know why he prefers to walk around the street than being in the house where he'll be taken care of. I'm, I'm, I'm just lost. Poor oh boy. I don't understand. Anyways. Just get ready. The kitchen is going to be Don't, don't oh, even please. sleep. Don't even sleep. <laughs> I will so sleep that uh -huh. every other person will be so, uh -huh. so jealous of you. Ah, uh -huh. wait now. I trust you. <laughs>
have done this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I ever laid my hands on you. I shouldn't have done that no matter what. But you know it hurts. It hurts to, to try so much just to please someone and it's never been appreciated. I try so much to make you happy but you never appreciate it. It's not my fault. You make me doubt myself. You make me feel as if I'm a bad person. But I am not. Junior, I love you. Your mother is my best friend. I can never hurt you. Even if you're angry with every other person, you shouldn't be angry with me. Because I love you so much. I was there with your mother. I was, I stood by her through thick and thin. She knows that. I know you can't talk, but I'm very sure you can hear me. Please, I love you so much. Don't worry, I'll make it up to you. You know what? Tomorrow, I'll take you for shopping. We'll go to the cinemas, see movies, buy you ice cream, and we'll go in search of mommy. Who knows? We might be lucky to find her. Yes, I know that's exactly what my boy wants to hear. Yeah, come, come to me. Get defend 
make sure I got the best for you for sure. Right? So that you be happy. You be happy. My boy. Big on Make you ice cream. Okay. Got plenty of things for you. After now, I'll take you to shopping. Okay. I'll buy you some good outfits. So that you will look very beautiful almost in the years. Right? Very good. So who is it? Who is it? Who is it? Who is it? Yeah, Alahadu Dan Gote. yourself what are you doing to yourself you barely talk to anybody you sit alone you talk to yourself why why are you doing this you no longer go out to teach your peoples are missing you I'm sure they will want to see you mama happiness is good you know I know when to be happy and when not to. And definitely this period is not a good one. You of all people should know that. Kedinobi. <laughs> Expect me to be happy when my only son is gone, gone under a mysterious circumstances. Mm. And the person that sniffed life out of my soul is probably out there breathing. And you expect me to be happy when there is no one to carry on with your father's lineage. No son, not even a grandson to show for it. I want your brother. I don't want to go to Kananti. I don't want to go to Kananti. I don't want to go there is nothing good. Nothing good will ever come out of our misyeke. One nigga mokaju. Our misyeke, they are like that. It has been there. And nobody will change it. We'll be a gong one maju. When is here no? Ne nom ka moto. Ne nom ka si we tichaka. You are going to marry someday and join your husband and me. I will join my ancestors. I'm on Nagechigo. Mama, stop. I don't like this thing you're saying. Stop. Mama, you're not dying. You're not going anywhere. If you leave me, where will I be? Where will I go to? Mama, you're not going anywhere. Stop. I don't like this thing you're saying. No. I don't like this thing. No. Hello, Mama, stop. Mama, stop. If you die now, what will happen to me? Mama, stop. Stop. Oh, Oh, 
You see the reason why I keep telling you people that men respect independent women. A woman that will not depend on her husband for the well-being of her home. You say women, Abby? Mm -hmm. Not all women. Exactly. You know Chigbo, the son of Okonkwo? Mm. The one that stays in Abuja now. Mm. His wife, Amobi, single-handedly built their home before Chigbo took over. That is the kind of life I want to build for myself. That's why I just hope my brother will marry um, Amobi's sister. I heard good fortune runs in their blood. <laughs> Where is she from? <laughs> what did you just say? Ami is sick now. Spit what you just said now. <laughs> Spit what out. Spit the rubbish you just said now. Which ain't it? They are not bad people. It's, just, it's not all of them that are bad. I say people put their hair together now. Put their hair together. Open your mouth and say nothing good comes out of Ami's sick. Open your mouth and say it. Hey! What did they call this one? Eh? You're still talking. You think I'm joking? I go slap this girl now. Ha, what has come over you now? What did I do that is bad here? Yeah, I didn't say anything wrong now. I will slap you now. Spit it out now. Spit it out. Well, I'll say what I've said before. I said it's not all of them that are bad. You see the talk. Ha, I will slap you now. What you has come over you now? What you just said now. You are telling her to slap me. You are telling her to slap Thank me. Thank Look for game for me. Thank game for me. Oh, you are going to find her again, Abby. You think I'm joking? What is that? You think I'm what is wrong with you now? What is wrong with you? You think I'm joking? You think I'm joking? You I'm not going to spit anything. Oh, you are going to the market. Yeah, stop that. Oh, give me. Oh, give me. Oh, give me. Go see, go see. Stop that. Call me out. Hey, 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 hey. Leave her alone. Leave her alone. So you went to bring my hey, hey. I'm you, you are going to look okay. What has happened by you? What's wrong with you? Stop that. Will you stop that rubbish? What kind of mentality do you guys have? That one person is talking bad about Ami Seke woman and the other one is talking good about Ami Seke women. That will make you to begin to fight. And you call yourselves friends. Hi. You kid Nubi. That your brother died mysteriously does not make every Amiseke woman bad. And that does not also make the man that marries Amiseke women to be dead. Let this be the first and the last time I will see you fight. Is that clear? You kid Nobi, go home. Tell your mother I want to see her immediately. Amaka, you, to your house. Go. I said leave.
I barged in on you, but honestly, I am so angry right now. I am sick and tired of Junior's weird attitude. I cannot take it no more. That is why I brought him here. I can't cope. I can't. Calm down, calm down. What's all this? Please calm down. I've not seen you this angry before. Not to this little boy. Not to Junior of all people. Fred, I'm tired. I'm honestly tired. What is all this? The other day, I was preparing for a location. Only for me to realize that the dress I brought out for the occasion has been burnt. By who? Junior. I woke up this morning to find out that my hair, my expensive hair, has been cut off with a scissors. By who? Same Junior. This little boy. What is all this? Please, please, please. I don't want to harbor him again in my house. I have tried. As a friend, I am. I have. Pierre, come lost. Of course you should be lost. Because what this little boy is doing is horrible. I can't take it anymore. <laughs> okay, fine. I understand what he has been passing through as a little boy. And yes, my best friend's son is also my son. I actually asked for this. I volunteered to help. But his weird attitude is becoming so unbearable for me and I can no longer take it. I can't. I mean, I don't know what he feels. I mean, maybe he thinks he's under house arrest and we are preventing him from going out to, to search for his mother. I don't understand. Whenever this weird attitude of his starts, he will try running out of the house. And when he's been prevented, he starts behaving crazy, scattering things in the house. Is that not madness? Look, please, I can no longer take this. I, I can't stand beating him because if I do, I will kill him. I don't want to kill someone's child. That is why I bought him for you. I'm tired. I am. I think the best thing to do is to let him go. That is why I have brought him to you. Please. My hands are off. I'm tired. What is all this? Ah.
everybody home. Is anybody home, please? Anybody home? Chilobi, Afumwe Lotana, Go Go Amobi, Ha Ego Go Amobi, Ego Go Amobi, Mo. Thank you. Kadi Luani. You don't need to do that, Mama. Thank you. Mama, if you need eh? Abba, may the chief continue to bless you. And your family. Thank you. Oh, Dalu. Hey, Afunwe Lotana. Oh no, Chiobi. Oh, you leave me ah. I go to the Hey, hey. Igu go a mo bi mu, Igu go a mo Ino chilobi o, ino chilobi. Afu wa, kila di sino, afu wa. I don't know I don't know I don't know I don't know I don't Afunwe lotana. Oyilin ni ya. Ogu gomo upi. Upi ni da chua. Onam. Nya da chuka na o. Your presence is gradually taking away my sorrow. Yes. I was without hope. Helpless. Until you arrive, do not completely. Until the killers of your father are brought to judgment. That is when my happiness will be complete. But for the meantime, let us be happy. Eh? Your presence makes me happy. I am happy. I'm happy. I'm happy seeing you. Ogogo Amobi. Afunwe Lotanea. I teach children. I want us to go to school today. Yes. Ogogwamobi. Today, we are going to school together. I teach my people. I look at you. I get inspired. And I teach them more. Afunwe <laughs> Lotanea. 
My next trip to Dubai will be on the 30th of next month, so you have enough time to, you know, take down the things you would want me to buy for you. And Bianca. Bianca! Are you here with me? Of course. Uh, I am. No, you're not. What is going on in that mind of yours? Uh, Angel is here. In my house. Angel? But I, I thought... I found her. Wow! Pretty nice. But what's up with the wrong face and oh I get it. The stress, right? Relax, everything will be fine, okay? Nay, Coco. My boy behaves weird. There is something strange about him. At times, it's as if he is communicating with the unseen. He doesn't even behave like a child. That gives me worry. That there may be something more to it. And I. Onyakuzi, mm? let me ask you what name do you call him? Afunwa Elotana. You see your late son in him. Yes. And if your late son gives you cause to worry, same goes with this little boy. From the very first time I set my eyes on this boy, I saw a missionary. A true missionary will never rest until he is so a mission is accomplished the mission must be fulfilled Welcome. 
Remember what we agreed on, eh? Angel will stay behind. When I go to the house to find out if the beat is still on. You understand? No, no, I don't think so. I don't think the villagers will still be angry with her till now. Are you brought her here to see her son? I'm sure he must have missed her so much. So just like you said, I'll leave her in the car. Eh? You have the point there. So, um... Of course. Be behind. Yes, I think he should be behind the house. He likes to stay alone, like father, like son.
What are you doing here? Angel. I can't find Angel. What do you mean you can't find Angel? I thought you left her in the car. Yes, I left her in the car like we agreed. But now I can't find her. How? I don't know. Where could she be? I don't just... You, we just have to look for her somehow, yeah. anywhere. I don't know. And let's just look for her. Angel! Hey, hey, excuse me, excuse me, please, what is happening here? It's Angelina now, the woman that committed abomination and has been on the run since she has been caught. And we are taking her to only court, Dora. Angel, court! Aba wa mo ni we mo Aba wa mo ni we mo Nwa mo si li si si je kwa kwo Nwa ma ya li si si je bo le le O koko ko ni we mo nya de ba Aba wa mo ni we mo Aba wa mo ni we mo Nwa mo si li si si that the chief priest of Moda is summoning us to new this school. Hey, you stop too much. Huh? In that what I'm doing, are you asking me to ask you? Hmm? Oh, problem, I don't know why I'm going to put you to work. Was I not drinking with you when we have been summoned? Let, let's not, please. Chiri, Chiri. Are you trying to insult me or you actually insulting me? No 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 no, 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 tell me. No, no, are you insulting me? No, 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 they're both. Let me go in, let me go in. No, no, I'm not insulting you. And I'm not trying to insult you. Let me go in. Well, let, let us hope all is well. Let, uh, but, but next time, mind the way you, you insult <laughs> me. Okay, so I'm talking too much. Is here. A day set aside by our chief to reveal what has been hidden from us. A boy was born. Little but mighty in the brain. He has been dumb all his life. Amanna. Nanolowa. Onochie. He was only sent to come and speak on the D-Day. 
Onwe lugo bwenje kili mwangu Onja nana mwangu Onwe lugo bwenje kili mwangu The time is here Do dumb people speak? Comes a time to kill a soul, but a time to heal the soul. A time to change to a chameleon. A time to be real. A time to lie. A time to be honest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A time to hide. And a time to speak up. Pick up, speak what you know now. Who is he speaking to? Do you have anything to say, Chelsea? Mm -hmm. Speak up or you remain dumb forever. The person who's worth your tears will never make you cry. What's going on? This is this is not you. You know, the one you intend walking down the aisle with. Please. Angel, you can do this for me. I love him so much. Yes, I do. I love him with everything I've got. I'm begging you in the name of God Almighty. Angel, you can do this for me. You can do this for a dying friend. I'm losing my mind. I love him so much. I love him. I can't do without him. This is the only man I've ever fallen in love with. The only man I have ever been connected to. 
please. I can I can start losing him. Not to you. Not to any other person in life. I can't. I'm obsessed with him. Please. Eka, this is crazy. What kind of obsession is this? This is this is crazy. He has no definition. And this is the more reason you should leave him for me. The prince is mine. He belongs to me. I love him so much. Please. You are the lucky one. You are favored. Once you go out, you acclimatize easily with people and you can easily fall in love with the man who, who returns it. And it's fine. But for me, the reverse is the case. I am, I am not favored like you. Please. You are the lucky one and you know that. I'm begging you. Please, just leave him for me. Do me this one favor, I beg of you, please. Eva, what are you saying? You... Our wedding is just a few days away and you're talking like this. You're supposed to be my friend. What, what are you saying? Cancel the wedding. Yes. Angel, you can do it for me. Cancel the wedding. It's not compared to half of what I've done for you. I've done enough for you. I've harbored you ever since up until you date. What have I done for you? I fight for you. I've stood for you when you have issues. And I sort them out. Bianca can take a bullet for you. When your stepmother was dealing with you, I stood in for you. I made sure they never suffered you. What have I done? I made sure the little money that your stepfather left for you was given to you. I deserve some accolade. Don't I? Why are you doing this to me? Please, I'm begging you. I love you so much. I've done enough for you. I was there. I was there as a father, as a mother, as the only sister you ever had. I was there. I made sure everything went right. Have I not tried? Now, you want to do this to me? Now? Okay. Now? The house is almost completed. You want to go and be happy? You want to go and live a life that is of trauma and allow me to suffer? Do I deserve this? Do I? I can know. The house I built is the same house that Prince will be living with me. He isn't established yet and I want to help establish him. I want to rewrite the wrongs. His people don't see anything good coming out of Amaisike and I want to change that. I want to have a happy home, building it with him. Please, please, Angel, what are you saying? You can do this for me. This is the only thing I've ever asked you to do for me. Why are you denying me this? Remember, I first met Prince before you. I was about letting my intentions know to him before you snatched him away no. from me. Yes, you did. You took him away from me. And now I'm losing my mind. I'm, I'm losing it already. Please, I beg you. I beg you, just leave, leave him for me. Just do me this one favor. This one favor and I will forever remain indebted to you. Please. What are you saying? Please. No. No, Angel. No. Why did you call me out here, Bianca? And why are you crying? Did you bring me here to start shedding tears? Divorce Angel and marry me. I have tried so much to get hold of myself, but I just couldn't. I could not. I... I... Excuse me? What did you just say now? Yes, Prince. I meant every word of it. Prince, I love you. I love you so much. I'm obsessed about you. Prince, I have never been attracted to any man in my life the way I am to you. Please, just give me a chance. Give me a chance. I, will, I promise that I will love you so much. Bianca, why are you so stubborn? Why don't you listen? We have talked about this over and over and over and over and over again. Don't you get tired? Why would you say that? I should leave your best friend to settle for you? 
Yes. Don't you have conscience? You should leave her. The more reason she should step aside and do me this favor. Angel is my best friend. She knows almost everything about me. She knows it's very difficult for me to get attracted to any man. She also knows that you are the only one I have ever been attracted to. She knows. Why can't she just do me this favor? I mean, why can't the two of you do me this favor? Is it too much? I've done so many things for her. Okay, fine. What is it that you see in Angel that you can't find in me? What? Love. Yes. L-O-V-E is what I see in her. I love your best friend, Angel, so dearly. And she loves me too. I mean, why is it difficult for you to listen? Why? You are a very beautiful woman. You can find love anywhere. But for me, it cannot work. It can't work for crying out loud. Okay. I'm sorry if I sounded rude. But as a friend, I am going to assist you to make sure you're happy. I can get you someone. Please. Please. This should be the last time we will talk about this. Don't call me out again for, 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 for this issue. Please. Prince. Tears are words waiting to be written. If I do not have you, no one else would. No one else. Is that a threat? It is just a message waiting to be delivered in full course. he inhale can leave him unconscious until you want. He can only be revived by the antidote anytime. Good job. I trust you. When are we getting our balance? Very important. I know. Send me your account details. Alright? Take it from here. Bianca leaves no traces. And I made sure he was not killed on the day he was kidnapped. I suffered him. I made sure he suffered the emotional trauma I went through before I sniffed the life out of him.
Why are you so stubborn, Prince? Do you really deserve this? Who are you doing all this for? Angel? Who is she? Is she anything compared to me? Chris, you're suffering yourself. Chris, I love you. I love you so much. Come with me, let's elope. Let's travel. Can't you see this love is real? Can't you see? Listen, I understand what you mean. I mean, I understand how terrible you feel right now. But I can handle Angel. She's nothing. Okay? Baby. I'm, I'm not happy seeing you like this. I'm, I'm not happy seeing you shed tears. When you shed tears, I feel horrible. Please. You know I love you so much. I love you. Come on, my love. I would rather get married to a dog than to get married to you. You would die. I promise you, you would die a miserable death. You're evil. That is who you are. You will die. You will die. my love away from me. Angel. Angel, I will make sure that your trauma never ends. I will! Hey. I, I had everything strategized for my good. I arranged the call. The dead prince's body was found. I took advantage that Angel's mother-in-law never liked her and wanted to deal with her. I never brought her to the village to see her son. Yes, because I miss seeing her tears. I miss watching her shed tears uncontrollably. Yes, I brought her here. I brought her down to this village. Knowing full well that she will suffer more trauma from the villagers. Angel. Angel hurt me so much. She made me suffer day and night. That is why each time I watch her shed tears. I shed tears with her not because I feel for her. But because I see that it's not enough compared to what she made me go through. The trauma she made me pass through. That is why I don't want her dead. I prefer to watch her suffer endless trauma all through her life. Hey. I tried so much to possess her son. But unfortunately, unfortunately that, that little brat was too troublesome for me to possess. Angel, I hate you. I hate you with everything in me. I despise you so much, Angel. For hurting me so much. For taking what rightfully belongs to me. I hate you with everything I've got inside of me. I despise you so terribly. You hurt me. And you, in, your, in your little mind. You think you could go away with it? Never! Trust me. Trust me, Angel. If you die today, I would kill myself and make sure we continue this battle in the world beyond. I ask you! Oh! 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 Oh!
Mission. Is that not the one they call her best friend? What's her name again? Oh, you know, Bianca. No. Her name is Boogie. Her name is Fulgon. A best friend can do this to a friend? Why are you shifting away, Mbako? Am I carrying sheets? Best friend. Best friend. Hey. Now what? Oh, you Bianca. Papa, I'm new. The mission is fulfilled. From time, something tells me that Angela has no hands in the death of the husband. The mission is fulfilled today. Yeah. 